Today we're doing some midpoint algebra. We know a midpoint is directly between two other points, which means that the two parts are going to be the same. So if we have these two parts being the same, 3x minus 1 and 4x minus 5, and we're trying to solve for x, we should set them equal to each other because we know the parts are the same. So we have 3x minus 1 is equal to 4x minus 5, and we can solve that equation just by adding 5 to both sides. And we have 3x plus 4 equals 4x, and then we need to subtract 3x from both sides. And we would get that x is equal to 4. What if we had a different scenario? Now we know the entire length and we only know one of the parts. Now take a second, think about it. How could we figure out what the length of this ms is? It could have a variable in it. We need to use the fact that we know that m is our midpoint. So if this entire thing bm is 2x, then ms is going to be 2x as well. Then we know both parts, 2x and 2x, and we know the whole, 12. The sum of the parts is equal to the whole, so we can add up 2x and 2x to get 4x, and that is equal to 12. Now to solve this equation, divide both sides by four, and you get x is three.